Good morning. Um, I'm so excited. He's going in a little later in the mornings, like 7.15 instead of 6.15. So I actually get to see Michael in the morning sometimes. A um, little bit of a, I haven't washed my face yet, so um, I don't know what's gonna happen. A little self-tanning fail, I missed a spot right there. You see that? Have one? Yeah, that can be corrected. That's the advantage to the spray tans, you just, but oh well. Bosley wants to go out. We're just having a little coffee. Jake's already gone. What time is it? 6.50. Come on. Jake's already gone. He has two finals today. We hope he does really, really well. He needs to do really, really well. No, it's, he doesn't have his meds till 8, sweetie. It's a little early. I did. Bosley's, for those of you who don't know, Bosley was diagnosed with, um, technically with cancer, I guess, in late August. Um, without opening him up, we won't know for sure, but they found two small tumors on his spleen and what they think are, have metastasized to his brain, lesions on his brain, and he's supposed to be dead. Somebody needs to tell Bosley that because he's fine. But he's on uh, thyroid medication twice a day and anti-seizure medication twice a day. Usually about eight and eight is when we give him his meds, but... He's, you know, I mean, he's 12 and a half years old, but. Buzz, buzz. You contemplating going down the stairs? You just want to look at things? Hi. Hi. You good boy. The Westies love to peer on the bridge. That's their thing. That's our garage that way. Um, which is really cool to have a detached garage, except when it's raining out. Then it's not so cool. All right. Well, I need to see if Shane is moving and shaking. I woke him up, but that doesn't mean he's actually out of bed. So I'm going to go check on him, and I'll see you guys later. Hey, guys. I am walking into my local library branch because it's time to vote. We're having a runoff for the San Antonio mayoral race, and early voting starts today. And the real vote is on Saturday, but I don't have time to go on Saturday. So I'm sure I cannot film inside, but here we go. Please turn off all, not just any, but all electronic devices. All right, let's go, Ivy Taylor. Okay, that took a total of two minutes. It took longer for them to look up my uh, validity by using my driver's license on the world's oldest laptop than actually cast the vote. It's a runoff, so there's only one thing on the ballot, and that's who do you want for mayor? And though I well, no, I really don't avoid any. I do not avoid controversial subjects. I will say I did vote for mayor, the current mayor, Ivy Taylor. I've met her several times. I've spoken to her. I'm very impressed with her. She's one heck of a smart woman. I love that she's not from San Antonio, so she's not particularly connected to any um, group or part of the old Texas network, which can get a little ridiculous, I have to say. Um, and I've never been a fan of her opponent, but... Either way, I think it's pretty progressive that the two options for mayor in San Antonio are both women, and um, that's pretty awesome. So I'm sure we'll be in good hands no matter what, but I will wear my I Voted sticker because that's awesome. Anyway, regardless of your party affiliation, I urge everyone to always participate in any election that you can. It is a privilege and uh, something we should not take for granted. That is my lecture for today. Now I'm gonna do the important stuff like go shopping at Marshall's for a backpack. I am chaperoning Shane's eighth grade end of year party at this big pool complex thing. And I can't figure out what bag to take. I know that sounds crazy, but I don't wanna bring a purse. Um, they're too big and I'm gonna be out in the sun all day and by the pool and the volleyball courts and I kinda want a little backpack or a crossbody. The crossbodies that I have, are frankly, just, I don't, they're too nice. I mean, I, I just need something easy and cheap. So I'm gonna hit up Marshall's and then Kohl's. I haven't been to Kohl's in forever. And maybe, hopefully we'll find something there. I looked at Target, found nothing. So off we go. Hey guys, I'm on my way to go into Kohl's. I went to Marshall's. It was a total picked over mess. Um, I haven't been to Marshall's in a really long time. I'm not sure if it's always like that or if it's just recently become awful. I don't know, but I haven't been to Kohl's. I keep forgetting Kohl's is even here. So let's see what we got.
Hey guys, you know that saying when it rains it pours? Well, it stopped raining here, but everything that could break in my house broke. The pool is not working. The air conditioning unit on the first floor, we have two air conditioning units, one for downstairs, one for upstairs. That's not working. Some of the lights out by the pool in the front of the house aren't working. <laughs> Anything else, guys? That's it. Look at Bosley. Like, he's hot. He's dying. It's 80 degrees in my house. It's almost 90 outside. It's only going to get worse. So, thankfully, my Dynamo air conditioning guy is on his way. He's hot. The pool guy is here working on the pool. The electrician is on his way. Thank goodness for having good vendors that I know to call. Bosley does not like the heat. Look at him. And Wrigley, that's Wrigley's rear end. Hello, Wrigley. I see you. Mimi, on the other hand, is stretched out on the punning green, getting as much sun as she can. So... She's my heat-loving little girl. She's a wackadoo. Hey guys, come on dogs, let's go. I'm in my jammies, although I haven't washed my face yet. Taking everybody out for one, whoa, Baz. Bosley just like literally jumped down the stairs. Hey, take it easy, big guy. You're a little bit crazy. Let's see the, oh, good boy, Wrigley. Mimi has been refusing to go down onto the grass lately. I don't know what's gotten into her. And then she decides to wake us up at 3 o'clock in the morning to go to the bathroom. So I am now actively trying to get them to do things. Go on, Mimers. I love seeing them at night. They glow. Go on, Mimi. Get off. Get off the patio. Go in the grass. She would just chase her around. Go play with Wrigley. Go no. No, Mimi. Hey. Stop! No, <laughs> you little... Mimi! Oh my god, that little... Mm, I can't say it. Mimi girl, you get down here! Mimi! Wow, it's a big bug. Mimi! Oh, look at her. Oh, you little brat. That's not the B word I'm thinking, but it's the B word I'm gonna say. You get your little tushy down here, young lady. We go pee pee outside. Come on. Nope. Let's go. Hey. Get. Go on. No. Come on. Go. That way. Uh-uh. Go. Keep going, your highness. Keep going. No. Mimi girl. Go. Hurry up. No, we do not stop on the stairs. Brat. Go on. I don't know where you think you're going. Get on the grass and go pee. Hurry up. Go on. Hey. There we go. All right, I'm gonna give her some privacy. Bosley is like bobbing for apples. What is he doing over there? She's just walking around in the grass. Hurry up, Mimi. Go potty. Hurry up. That works for Wrigley. Mimi, not so much. Hey, Buzz. Mimi! She's eating grass. What are her little... Hey, Buzz. Where are you? Hurry up, Mimi. Go potty. Hurry up. She still hasn't peed. Unbelievable. It's a pretty moon. There's the moon. Oh my god, she's still wandering way back there. I see you! Hurry up! Go potty! The boys, everybody else is peed except you. Let's go. Unbelievable. Okay, well, I tried to get the dogs doing something cute. Of course, as soon as I turn on the camera, everybody stops what they're doing. I feel like I'm getting eaten alive by mosquitoes or something. I'm itching all over. So I am going to say goodnight. And tomorrow, hopefully, will be some interesting vlog footage. I am chaperoning all day Shane's eighth grade party that it is a like a local sports park with a pool. They have a DJ, volleyball courts. I'm kind of crazy for volunteering to do this because I hate being outside in the heat and it's supposed to be 90 degrees tomorrow. Okay, do you hear all those creepy bugs? I'm getting in the house. Good night, everybody. <laughs> Thank you for watching. And the deep, dark Texas night. I will see you tomorrow. Bye.
I have a huge love affair going on with the latest launch from Clinique. It is their Clinique Pop Lip Color Plus Primer at Lipsticks. 